I bet you didn't know that motion is everywhere. Cars drive, planes fly, and factories hum with activity. But beneath the surface, there's a whole other world of motion happening at a microscopic level. Vibration. Vibration is the oscillation of an object around an equilibrium point. In equipment maintenance, vibration is a critical indicator of the health of machinery. It can reveal imbalances, misalignments, and other issues that, if left unchecked, can lead to equipment failure. Understanding and monitoring vibration helps in predictive maintenance, ensuring machines run smoothly and efficiently. Stay tuned to learn how this knowledge can save you time, money, and headaches. Not all vibrations are bad. In fact, some are perfectly normal. Imagine a bicycle wheel spinning. It vibrates slightly, right? That's expected and nothing to worry about. The same goes for motors, bearings, and shafts. They all have a natural frequency at which they vibrate when operating. Think of a guitar string. Pluck it gently, and it vibrates at a specific frequency, producing a musical note. Too much vibration can be destructive, just like over-tightening a guitar string can cause it to snap. So, how do we tell the difference between good and bad vibrations? By measuring the intensity and pattern of these vibrations, we can identify subtle changes that might signal trouble brewing inside our machines. Imagine a brand new car fresh off the assembly line. You turn the key and the engine purrs to life with a gentle hum. This subtle vibration is a good sign. It's the sound of hundreds of perfectly engineered parts working together in harmony. Just like that new car engine, every rotating component in a machine has a signature vibration. Think of it like a fingerprint. Each component has its own identifiable vibration signature. We measure these vibrations using special sensors that detect even the slightest movements. These sensors are like super sensitive microphones, picking up the faintest whispers of motion within a machine. By studying these vibration signatures, we can establish a baseline for normal operation. This baseline acts as a reference point, allowing us to quickly identify any deviations that might indicate a problem. Bearings are the unsung heroes of the mechanical world. These small but mighty components allow rotating parts to move smoothly and efficiently. Think of them as tiny dancers, gracefully gliding and spinning under immense pressure. A healthy bearing will produce a very specific vibration signature, characterized by low amplitude and high frequency. However, even the slightest imperfection in a bearing can throw off this delicate dance. By carefully analyzing the changes in a bearing's vibration signature, we can pinpoint the exact nature of the problem. This early detection allows us to replace or repair the bearing before it fails catastrophically, saving time, money, and potential damage to other components. Motors and shafts are the powerhouses of many mechanical systems, responsible for converting energy into motion. Like any rotating component, they too have a unique vibration signature that reveals a lot about their health. A properly balanced and aligned motor and shaft assembly will rotate smoothly, producing a low amplitude steady vibration. This harmonious vibration indicates that the forces acting on the system are balanced and everything is working as it should. However, imbalances or misalignments can throw this delicate system out of whack. Just like a wobbly tire on a car, an unbalanced rotor or a misaligned shaft will cause vibrations to increase dramatically. This can lead to excessive wear and tear on the motor, bearings, and other components, eventually resulting in premature failure. Imagine driving your car and suddenly hearing a loud thumping noise. You wouldn't just crank up the radio and ignore it, would you? No way. That thumping is your car's way of telling you something's wrong. Abnormal vibration is a machine's cry for help. It's a clear sign that something isn't right and needs attention. Ignoring these warning signs is like ignoring a flashing check engine light. It's only a matter of time before things go from bad to worse. When a machine starts to develop problems, its vibration signature changes. The smooth, rhythmic hum might become erratic, with spikes in amplitude or shifts in frequency. These changes are like red flags, alerting us to potential issues. 
By analyzing the changes in a machine's vibration signature, we can diagnose problems and take corrective action before they escalate. Remember those tiny dancers, the bearings, working tirelessly inside our machines? When they start to complain, you better listen up. A bearing in distress will sound very different from its healthy counterpart. Instead of a smooth, high-frequency hum, a damaged bearing might produce a high-pitched squeal, a grinding noise, or a rhythmic clicking sound. These noises are caused by imperfections on the bearing surfaces, such as pits, cracks, or wear patterns. As these imperfections worsen, the vibration amplitude increases, and the once graceful dance becomes more of a desperate struggle. The type of noise and the pattern of vibration can tell us a lot about the specific problem affecting the bearing. For example, a high-pitched squeal might indicate lack of lubrication, while a rhythmic clicking could point to a damaged ball or raceway. Motors and shafts, the dynamic duo responsible for converting energy into motion, can also throw some pretty impressive temper tantrums when things aren't right. Remember that well-tuned engine hum we talked about? Well, imagine that engine suddenly starting to sputter, shake, and vibrate violently. That's what happens when a motor or shaft assembly is out of balance or misaligned. One of the most common causes of abnormal vibration in motors and shafts is imbalance. Imagine attaching a small weight to one side of a spinning top. It would wobble and vibrate as it spins, right? The same thing happens with a motor rotor. Misalignment is another major culprit. If the motor shaft and the shaft of the driven component are not perfectly aligned, they will fight each other as they rotate creating excessive vibration and wear. Think of it like trying to push a shopping cart with a wobbly wheel. It takes a lot more effort, and you're likely to end up going in circles. So far, we've talked about vibrations as if they were some kind of mystical force living inside our machines. But in reality, it all boils down to basic physics. Everything in the universe, from the tiniest atom to the largest star, vibrates at a certain frequency. Remember that guitar string analogy? When you pluck a guitar string, you're giving it energy. This energy causes the string to vibrate back and forth at a specific frequency, creating the sound waves that reach our ears. Rotating machinery works in a similar way. Each component has a natural frequency at which it vibrates when excited by external forces. When a machine is running smoothly, these forces are balanced, and the vibrations remain within a predictable and acceptable range. Bearings, those tiny dancers with a big job, are particularly susceptible to vibration problems. Remember, their whole purpose is to allow rotating parts to move smoothly against each other with minimal friction. But when a bearing starts to fail, the smooth waltz turns into a destructive mosh pit. Imagine zooming in on a healthy bearing with a super-powered microscope. You'd see perfectly smooth surfaces, with the balls or rollers gliding effortlessly along the raceways. Now, imagine that same bearing with a tiny dent or scratch on one of the raceways. As the balls or rollers pass over this imperfection, they create a tiny impact, generating a vibration that travels through the bearing and the surrounding structure. As the damage worsens, these impacts become more frequent and severe, leading to increased vibration and noise. The once smooth surfaces become rough and pitted, increasing friction and generating heat. It's a vicious cycle of destruction that can quickly escalate if left unchecked. Imbalance is one of the most common causes of excessive vibration in rotating machinery, and it's all about uneven distribution of mass. Think of a washing machine with an unevenly loaded drum. It shakes and vibrates violently during the spin cycle, right? The same principle applies to rotating components like motor rotors, fan blades, and even car tires. Any uneven distribution of mass will create a centrifugal force that pulls the rotating part off-center, causing it to wobble as it spins. This wobble, or imbalance, generates vibration that travels throughout the machine, causing excessive wear and tear on bearings, supports, and other components. The greater the imbalance, the more violent the vibration, and the faster the damage occurs. 
Imagine a playground seesaw with one side heavier than the other. It's impossible to balance, right? The heavier side will always pull it down. Misalignment, as the name suggests, occurs when the axes of rotation of two coupled shafts are not perfectly aligned. This can happen due to various factors, such as manufacturing tolerances, thermal expansion, or even improper installation. Think of trying to connect two garden hoses with slightly different sized fittings. You can force them together, but the connection will be strained and prone to leaking. The same principle applies to misaligned shafts. When two shafts are misaligned, they create a bending moment as they rotate. This bending moment acts like a lever, trying to force the shafts apart. The shafts resist this force, creating stress and friction that generate vibration and heat. Imagine trying to steer a shopping cart with one wheel pointing slightly in the wrong direction. It's a recipe for disaster, right? You'll end up fighting the cart, and it will be much harder to control. That's what happens with misaligned shafts. They fight each other as they rotate, creating excessive vibration and wear. As we've explored throughout this journey into the world of vibration, it's clear that these seemingly invisible forces play a crucial role in the performance and longevity of our mechanical systems. Far from being a nuisance, vibration is an inherent part of motion, a symphony of forces that governs the dance of gears, bearings, and shafts. Imagine a bustling factory floor filled with the whirring of machinery, the rhythmic thumping of presses, and the gentle hum of conveyor belts. Each sound, each vibration, tells a story about the health and well-being of the machines responsible for our modern world. By embracing vibration analysis as a routine part of maintenance, we gain valuable insights into the inner workings of our machines, allowing us to optimize performance, extend lifespan, and ensure the smooth operation of the countless systems that power our world. In a world dominated by visual stimuli, it's easy to overlook the importance of sound. Listening to our machines can be as valuable as inspecting them visually. Subtle changes in sound and vibrations alert us to problems before they become visible, like a doctor using a stethoscope to detect health issues. A skilled technician can identify problems by listening to vibration patterns. This involves understanding normal vibration signatures and recognizing deviations. By honing our listening skills, we become proactive guardians of our mechanical assets. We've all experienced the frustration of a mechanical breakdown, whether it's a car that won't start, a computer that crashes, or a critical piece of equipment that grinds to a halt. These failures are not only inconvenient, but can also be costly and disruptive. The good news is that many of these breakdowns can be prevented with a proactive approach to maintenance, and vibration analysis plays a crucial role in this effort. By monitoring vibration patterns over time, we can identify wear and tear, misalignments, imbalances, and other issues before they escalate into catastrophic failures. Regular vibration analysis allows us to monitor the health of our machines, identify potential issues before they become major problems, and take corrective action to prevent costly downtime, saving time, money, and frustration in the long run. As we conclude our exploration of vibration in mechanical systems, it's clear that these unseen forces are not something to be feared, but rather understood and embraced. By learning to interpret the language of vibration, we unlock a deeper understanding of our machines, enabling us to optimize their performance, extend their lifespan, and ensure their reliable operation. Think of a skilled musician coaxing beautiful music from a complex instrument. They don't just hit notes randomly. They understand the nuances of the instrument, how each component interacts with the others, and how to manipulate those interactions to create the desired sound. Similarly, mastering the world of vibration allows us to become machine whisperers, able to diagnose problems, predict failures, and maintain our mechanical systems with a level of precision and efficiency that was once unimaginable. So, the next time you hear the hum of a motor, the whirring of a fan, or the gentle clicking of a bearing, take a moment to appreciate the symphony of motion unfolding before you. For within those vibrations lies a wealth of information, waiting to be unlocked by those who dare to listen.